Well, hello, hello, my beautiful people. My name is Gat, and welcome back to... You know what we're playing right now. We're playing Zero Ops. Last time, we were in a little meeting, planning our plan of attack to, you know, attack the Ares Confederation. And yeah, that was basically it. We talked with Brooke, you know, to calm her nerve, talked to Alan, you know, to get kind of pumped up a little bit. Probably didn't work because our boy is depressed. He is depressing, man. Alrighty, without further ado, let us continue. If their force is geared towards the fence. I flipped through the documents projected on my desk, looking for a specific starship analysis report, only to be forced to give up moments later. I should have expected as much, given the nature of the UTV's counterattack efforts, but the lack of concrete information on the Ares arsenal really is dis disparring. Considering our scouts were only able to identify mercs and pirate forces at all, it's probably safe to say they still largely operate their own vessels rather than an unknown Ares one, so it's probably safe to rely on the database for that at least. Even if I wasn't the one who faced them personally, as long as the fleet compri composition is similar to what Brooks dealt with at, with at Neil Hampshire during our patrols, we should be okay. No matter what the case is, Facing down a swarm is still nerve-wracking, no matter how confident I may be in the plan in the plan, or Sierra and her arsenal. At least it makes my unprepared and weak act seem more convincing. Assuming I don't actually make a big enough blunder to land us in hot water. I lean to my seat, stomach stomaching a sigh. <sighs> Captain of the Sierra, Commodore of Tau, huh? Why can't I seem to calm down? Frustrated, I shoot up from my seat. I need to do something if I want to stay sane tonight. Like calling Doc. The old man did say call him more, didn't he? Hmm? Looks like it's a message from Captain Brooks. long time since I played against an actual person. Then again, I never played against anyone but him. Maybe it's time to change that. Assuming getting closer to her isn't a mistake to begin with. Looks like it's a message from Falio. Good evening, Fahrenheit. Excuse me for sending you this informant informal invitation, but I was wondering if you have any interest in discussing recent events. I'll find friendly banter tends to improve performance the day afterwards, so please consider this seriously. I'll be in my room, should you decide to accept my offer. Sign, Alan S. Valley Valerio. What a formal sounding, informal invitation. He's going out of his way to invite me to chat? It may be worth going to just to hear what he wants to discuss in particular. I'm no expert at reading people, but if he really has a secondary motive, I'll find out about it sooner or later. It's just a question of wh whether or not it's now. Or ever. Do I really want to get myself mixed up with a noble? Mm. I shut down my desk. My options ruminating in my mind. I guess I have to make a choice, huh? Okay, right, first of all, let's see. There's crew quarters. Okay, so there's Brooks. What about this one? There's the father. And there's Alan. Off the bat, you know, dad, like, Doc, yeah, I'm not calling you. I ain't calling you at all. You abandoned me. And also, you're kind of not that interesting, in my opinion. Like, out of these two, Alan and Brooks, you're just not that maybe it's because I don't really know too much of your story maybe if we talk to him he's like well yeah I actually you know serve in the marines when I was younger like something like that you know what I mean 
But no, you're out. Alan or Brooks? I kind of want to see what Alan wants to say because he's like so mysterious with his nobility and junk. But Brooks, she has chess, man. She has chess. I'm sorry. I love, I love chess, man. I remember playing it with my dad when I was what? I think I want to say eight when he taught me how to play. Then I used to play with my friend in um during lunch in high school. So we're gonna go play chess with Brooks. Boom! Please be a mini game. Please be a mini game. Ah, sorry, water. Sorry, water break. Hmm. This seems like the right room. I guess I should just, I should just knock. Mm hmm? Fahrenheit? I didn't think you'd get here so early. Were you expecting someone else? Quick, get in! Hmm? What? Wait, what? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Grabbing my arm, she dragged me inside before throwing op open one of the room lockers and gesturing me to hide between the hung up suit jackets. Go, go! You'll be here in a second! Um. Trust me on this one! Uh, alright. Well, I come this far. Making sure I don't hit my head on the top rack, I casually step into the semi-filled steel storage container. It's only when the door starts to close does it register what I'm exactly I'm doing. Why am I in a locker? Giving up on this half-hunched position, I let my knees slowly relax, sliding down against the wall till I'm on the floor, my knees uncomfortably shoved up against my chin. Why in the world did I agree to this? At least my eye level is at is about where the slits are. Who do I see? Squinting, I stare out into the room beyond the to be the disturb, disturbing lack of Captain Brooks. Hero's will. She didn't just leave me like this, did she? Leaning against the door of the locker, I just barely make out the the edge of her heel standing by the entryway. I guess she was waiting for someone after all. Are those footsteps? They're getting closer. So, you're finally here! There's no need to raise your voice, ma'am. Is that Alan? Sorry, I'm a little anxious today. I suppose that is understandable, considering the circumstances. However, Please keep your voice down. This is not not either one of our vessels. Yes, yes, of course. Anyway, what's all on the menu today? Pasta, stir fried scallops, a parfait maybe? Why do you assume it's about food? When you have... <laughs> when have you ever gone out of your way to come over when it's not about food? Mmm... Omelette rice. It's omelette rice. Only omelette rice? Wow, you really packed light. It's against regulations to bring large fire houses onto, onto an official UTV ship without direct permission from the captain. I swear to God, if that's what, what Alan wanted to talk about. <laughs> Just imagine I went with Alan like, Sir, I wanted parfaits. What? I wanted parfaits, you know, parfaits with the uh, crazy toppings that kind of look like ice cream a little bit, sir. Par parfaits? Why? Because they are delicious. They are quite nutritious, if you ask me, sir. <laughs> like, come on, Alan. I'm sure Fahrenheit wouldn't mind, as long as you you're actually careful, right? Quiet down, ma'am. You will disturb the neighboring rooms. Of course. How rude of me. Mm. He sighs before opening the large tub and pulling out a lunchbox with a small bottle of some sort of red sauce stacked on top of it. Please clean and return the containers to my room as always. Of course. Thanks, Alan. Mm. Do not blame yourself, ma'am. Huh? Yeah. Good night. The door opened. 
<laughs> the door outside slides shut, just slowly enough for me to make out the sound of Valio's, Valio's footsteps echoing down the hall. Did he really come to deliver dinner? Hey! Hey! Sorry for the delay! How are you doing? Still good? Good enough? She offers me a hand, helping me up as I stretch my legs. Ah, maybe hunching over was the better idea after all. Anyway, want some omelet rice? She fishes out a plate alongside with a set of utensils from somewhere at the back of her shelf. She was definitely expecting this. Would it be possible for you to explain to me just what just happened first? It's exactly what it looked like. Alan Thalio, second son of the Thalio family, likes to indulge in the ancient art of making homemade, me homemade meals before battles. Apparently, it's his way of helping with morale before a big mission. <laughs> but really, he just likes to experiment with cooking. Damn it, Alan, you should have said that. I would have went to you first. No lie, I bet you he had like pizza, tacos, burritos, you know, burgers or some stuff like that, man. Like, Alan, come on, my dude. How can you make a rookie mistake like that? Not that I'm complaining. All, all the end results are delicious. It's usually a lot of more elaborate, elaborate than this, though. Guess he's still testing the waters of what he can, can do aboard Sierra. My see. What do you think? Wanna try some? He made it for you, didn't he? Do you think I can finish this on my own? He offers me a glance at, of the open lunchbox. It does smell pretty good. Alright, but just a bit. I knew it. You're a compli- <laughs> You're a compli- <laughs> Comp- Complit- Complit- You're complic- you're conflicted now, by the way. I expect a note of gra grant. <laughs> I expect a note granting him freedom to bring all of his equipment over my desk by tomorrow morning. I'll consider it. Okay, let me see who's winning. Hold on. I see something stupid. Where's my king? My king is gone, huh? Cause there's um one over there. There's a no, this is in check. Okay, look. These are black, right? And these are the white tiles. I could tell. So look. And if you look over here. This is a king. Her is probably a black one, right? And there's the white one. Queen. Mine. It's a checkmate already. It has to be. There's no fucking way. I sit across Brooks with my stomach pleasantly full and a chessboard filled with hologram holographic pieces between us. I hate to admit it, but there's no way for me to get out of this. Checkmate. You got lucky that time. Who's the one who... With two wins under their belt again? I'm just out of practice. Plus, it's getting late. Really now? Are you sure you're not just a sore loser? Let's just say both and call things even. Even? I didn't know you value your dignity so little, Fahrenheit. What would your squadron think once they learned that their mighty Commodore... Can't even beat a pretty lady like me at chess. What? You're not a Commodore now. You're you're not a Commodore now. Oh, I am. I'm just egging you on. You see? Is it working? Um. <laughs> Are you really supposed to be my mentor? Sorry, Fahrenheit. You're stuck with me. Maybe if you cut back on the puns, it wouldn't be too bad. I tried. I looked down at my tablet. Crap, it's gone pretty late. Running away isn't gonna save you. Who said I was running away? 
Reset the board. Ha! With the smuggest smile on her face, she waves her hands over the field, sending the projected pieces to their original positions. Determined to give, keep my pride intact, I pushed my brain to remember the matches I had with the arrogant asshole all those years ago. Damn, damn it. My, my, my win ratio with him wasn't much better either. Ha! Huh. Oh, I even let you go first. Try not to disappoint me too much, okay? It would be pretty embarrassing after I defeat, defeat, defended you in front of everyone. Uh-huh. Jokes aside, don't be surprised if you get chewed out in the future. The more respect people like Manyard, Manyard have for you, the harsher they'll tend to get when you do mess up. Sounds like you're speaking from experience. A bit, yeah. Helion thing, Helion's thing was always more silent disappointment, though. The less he said, the more disapproving he was. <laughs> what is he, a parry? <laughs> Compared to that, I'd probably take Manyard yelling at me any day. I see. More respect means more criticism, huh? I guess in a sense, taking the efforts to point out mistakes is a, is a sign of caring and expectation. Whether or not it actually does good. I guess it's up to context. I move my piece before focusing my eyes on her expression as she studies the board. Nope, can't read her at all. Maybe I attacked this the wrong way. He was always a more defense-oriented player, so more often than not, matches ended up going for days. Captain Brooks, on the other hand. Come on, Fernando, you can do better than this. I move another piece. I think this may actually work out. Am I doing that badly? I can't say I haven't seen... I can't say I haven't seen worse, but it's up there. Hey, I'm trying. At this rate, you're going to lose to a pretty lady like me. I quietly shift the piece into place. Now, how do I keep her from noticing? Hmm. For the record, you are indeed very pretty. What? Did becoming utterly Trump, Trump knock a few screws loose or something for night? Don't tell me you were allergic to something in the islands at omelet rice. No, I'm just winning. Wait, what? Checkmate. Mm? <laughs> you clever asshole. <laughs> Be glad this wasn't a legitimate match or I, I would have thrown the book at you for underhand tactics. I'm just stating the truth. <laughs> I'm just stating the truth, girly. You are pretty cute. I'm not gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie about that, okay? Brooks is pretty cute. Like, let me see. Well, then again, she's like the only female. No, Freya's cute too. Mm, I don't know. I talk more to Brooks than Freya. So, Brooks, you are pretty cute. I'm just stating the truth. What? Being honest is the underhand is underhanded now? Uh-huh. Careful, smooth talker. Flattery may, may just get you something. Let me guess. A rematch? Now you're getting the picture. In all seriousness, we should be retiring for the night. Oh, come on, Fahrenheit. Don't get all Alan on me now while we're having so much fun. What's wrong with treating my wing partner with a little respect? And here, I was thinking we would become friends. Sorry, pal. I'll try to be more casual with you. I'm starting to see why Red calls you a brat. Does he now? More often than you know. I'm not surprised. Well, if you insist on going to bed, I guess we can postpone a rematch to, ne to the next time. What do you think? Yeah, why not? I hate love chess, man. I don't see why not. To keep track of our win and loss ratio, ratio, <laughs> ratio, ratio, so we can just see how bad you are. Thanks, I appreciate it. You're very welcome. Well, 
क्या सोच रहा सी ऑन द रे गुड नाइट नहीं प्लेइंग चेस अगेन हां दा 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 हम हम दा 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 para para pa ba ta ta ra ra ta 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 ra ta 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 ra ra ta ta pa 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 ra ta ta oh shit the smell of smoke burns in my lungs can anyone hear me surrounded by twisted metal 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 and shattered glass i crawl at the crumbling concrete and the exposed beams Fire licks at my skin, but I press forward. I need to get out. I need to get out. I need to get out. Laughing shadows flashes along the shattered walls, dancing with the thriving flames. One spots me and whispers into my ear. Oh, look what we have here! What is a little boy doing here all alone? Mhm. Mm get away! A thousand eyes stare down at me. I tried to pull away, but the rubble pins me in my place. Did you hear? The doctor's son hasn't finished his. <laughs> Did you hear? The doctor's son hasn't finished his degree at the Damascus. That's. What? Why is he a captain then? That's just not fair. What? That why is he captain then? That doesn't look fair to anyone else. What do you expect? Signal does whatever it takes to keep the doctor happy. I Even after getting lucky, all you did was fail. Why were you even the one picked when you were when there are other 100 when there's others 100 times better? People like you are the reason the world is so messed up. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Uh, my eyes open to my empty cabin. The lights flickering on on from my abrupt spasm. 203 set. What the hell are you doing, Junius? Why are you remembering everything now of all times? Wasn't 6 years ago enough time to deal with all this bullshit? It's time to move on. Good night. I whispered to no one in particular. Good night. <laughs> just imagine like out of nowhere, like like Brooks or Red or whatever. They're just like good night. <laughs> the trump of my heart beat measures each passing second. All units, prepare to engage on my command. My grip tightens around the controls. If we can't prove that the UTV can't fight back, there's no chance of us winning this war. <clears throat> Lapis is re ready and waiting. Initiate full remote functionality. No matter what, we have to make this count. Prepare for battle. Prepare. Start battle. Mm, prepare. All right, let's see. Weapons. Well, we got most of them that we need. What about this one? Well, we have one log, so we got this guy. I'm not gonna lie. Look at this guy. That's Helion. That is Helion. At first, I'm like, he looks familiar. That's Helion, man. Mm, let's see. I think I might take this guy then, cause he's a captain and shit. He's supposed to be in this battle anyway. Start the battle. Do you wish to begin the battle? Yeah, cause I press start the battle. Why? Why the fuck wouldn't I? Your valid's effort has been rewarded. More UTV reinforcements. Opportunity missed. Lapis boost temporary. Confirming full control of Lapis. Keep an eye on the con on the connection. Inform me immediately if anything unexpected happens. Gotcha. What's the situation ahead? They appear to be behaving as predicted, sir. Captain.
the mayor and Captain Helian have been already engaged with enemy troops. Uh, we've detected a significant group ahead of us still. Should information th should inform the Admiral that we'll be waiting. No, we'll scramble. We'll move forward as was. No, we'll move forward was planned. The, the more scrambled their units are, the better. As long as we take, <laughs> as long as it will take for the first to take position, three minutes. If everything goes according to to plan, Captain, then that's how much time we need need to have to clear the lane. Tower squadron, advance. Okay. All right. Let's let's see what we're working with first. Okay. So there's four. Okay. You, I'm gonna need to go there. And attack. I need to attack the, that fool first. And me, I think I'll help out. Go forward and attack that fool. Alright, we'll put on weapons and shields. We don't really need thrusters because we're kind of already close. So, alright, go. And let's have two. Shit, he's fast. This, this shit's really fast. Stop engaging. Get away. Let's help this guy. Sierra, go attack these guys. All right, let's slow it down. Let's slow it down. Okay, Helon, you're kind of fucked right now. Get the fuck away from the battle. And let me take your Kamehameha. He can only attack troops, but I need you to attack projectiles and frames for that one. This one can go on troops, okay? You kind of need protection, my dude, because you are kind of screwed. Let's send an EMP blast. Okay, cool. Get behind Sierra. Alright, and now just attack that fool. Ah, uh, fuck. Go, 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 go. We need to protect this fucker. Because Sierra will do fine. Sarah's okay. This guy. Helion, I don't want you to die. Stay close to Sierra. Baby boy, stay close to Sierra. Please tell me you're almost dead. Please tell me you're almost dead. Okay, this guy needs to pull back. Like, a lot. EMP! Yeah, you need to pull back, my dude. The airways took the bait! The Adderall's moving to the play third fleet! They'll be here in 60 seconds! Captain, enemy reinforcement is incoming from Sector 3. Did they catch on? Keep fighting. We can't let the Ares regain their foothold. Wait, what? Oh, fuck. Where? I don't see shit. Hold on. Yeah, I don't see shit. They're coming. They're coming, though. Helion, you're fucked. Just keep attacking them and you'll be fine. Keep attacking them and you'll be fine. Hopefully. Hopefully, my guy. Hopefully. Woo! You're gonna die. He's dead. He's dead as shit if he keeps getting hit. Okay. Command. Take command. Take command. Uh. Take out these smaller ones. You can do it. You have enough. You have enough firepower. Okay. Don't die. <laughs> I'm sorry. I might get into it. Don't die, fucker. Don't. He's gonna die. He's gonna die right now. Yeah, there's no way. He's dead. Heal on! Fuck! We lost Helion! Shit! Well, he only did what he loved to do. I'm dying. He only had to suck. Oh shit! The areas are moving to regroup! Damn it! Keep fighting! We need to hold this lane clear for, for third! Incoming! Press F4 to launch Lapis. Lapis, go! You're gonna die though. Lapis, go! What is Lapis gonna do? 
Engaging. Enemy targets. Acquired. Lapis is on the move. Ugh. Gundam frame, go! Where? Hold on. F4 to switch between Seer and Lapis. Okay, cool. Lapis. What is Lapis doing? Where is Lapis? Oh. What? That's stupid. I'm sorry. Why though? Oh, he takes him out easily. That's kind of cool. In a way. But why though? All right, I need to switch to Sierra because I don't know what we're doing. No, I gotta take that one out. Lapis, cause I like using it a little bit now. I'm not gonna lie, if gameplay was like this, I, I think I would love it. Like low key, if it was like this, I think I would love it. Where are the any, oh, they're right here. Lapis, there's more over there. Acknowledge, going to destroy. Going to destroy now. Destroy it. Doi. Dirty shit. You can't stand up to Lapis. I said you can't stand up to Lapis. There you go. You're dead. <laughs> Third's almost through. Hold on for a bit longer. Come back to Lapis, fool. You think I care about you? You think I care about you? Nah, not even a bit. Engaging. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, Lapis kicks ass. I think he's too OP. Like, literally, Helion fucking died. Like, easily. I think this is like too much for Lapis, man. Acknowledge. Killing the enemy. Kill, kill, kill. Um, Lapis, you need to calm down. What if they surrender? They don't surrender. Kill. Do nothing but kill. Lapis, you're scaring me. They don't deserve to live. Kill. <laughs> kill. <laughs> kill. Kill, kill, kill. in position. Airways forces are scrambled. How is first faring? No casualty reported, sir. First fleet is moving to counterattack as we speak. Keep me updated on their situation. If they need support, let me know immediately. Understood. C Captain, incoming transmission from the Airways. What? Which ship is signaling for coming from? Moving to trace the signal now. The signal's coming from the ship over there. I'm highlighting it now. A unique signature. There's nothing in the database, so it's likely a customized SIP. Don't tell me it's your commanding officer. Should I patch it through, sir? Go ahead. Are you the commanding officer for this fleet? <laughs> Not bad, but you're pretty generous if you're calling this barely organized chaos a fleet. Rear Admiral Reinhard Radziski. I thought it's only polite if I saw my opponent face before we battle it out to the death. Credit where credit is due. You put this sacrificial lamb into the pickle. I hope I'm drawing this out for another few months so I'll have a chance to tame this band of misfits, but I guess even Terrans refuse to lie down and die. Surrender now? There's been enough death already. Oh, I quite agree. Wouldn't it be great if things could end peacefully? But do you really think this war would have started if it were possible? Hmm. 
Come, let's see what's your what is what is more worthy of. <laughs> let's see who is more worthy of victory. All right, bet, bet. Enemy commander incoming. Prepare for battle. We're not, we're not, <laughs> we're not ending the. We're ending this. All right. Uh, we need to switch. Okay. I need the Sierra to go over here. And I need to monitor its health and the shields. Okay, cool. You did that. Now, Lapis, take control. You'll be taking out all these, like, weak ones. While they go after the battle fleet. Protect the main fleet right now. Lapis, protect the main fleet. Fuck, they're shooting me. Take out the weak ones, not the not the big ones. Acknowledge! They all shall die in my hand! There's no more little ones. There are no more little ones! They're all like the big ones! Lapis is gonna die. Lapis is gonna die. I need to pull back. Ah, fuck. 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 Ah! Damn it. These guys are dying over here. I need to switch for a bit. Come on. You. I need you targeting their flagship over here. That's all you gotta do. All right, bet. Let's go back to Lapis. Damn it, Lapis is dead. We need to take this guy out now. Damn it, this fleet is dying. All my fleets are dying around me. Damn it, Lapis, I'm gonna need you to protect me. Finish your prepares now. There's these little little baby ones right here. Acknowledge! Damn it. Dude, they're all surrounding Sierra right now. Sierra doesn't have its shields. Sierra's gonna die. Sierra's gonna die right now. Sierra's gonna die. Sierra's gonna die. Fuck! Critical failure! Fuck! Recalibrate. I'm not ending this. Alright, and we're back to killing this asshole. Like, we managed to keep... What is it? Helion alive, but we kind of lost him right now. Like, we just lost him now, man. Okay, I saw this shit. Come on. Alright, we gotta see it again. Ah! Brah. 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 Acknowledge. Who am I killing today, master? You're killing the enemy. Killing him good, hopefully. Uh, yeah, hopefully. Alrighty. Alright, now let's get Lapis. Acknowledge! Uh. Uh, get the enemy! Alright, now hopefully we are getting the effing out of here. My lord, get... Let the fleets and Lapis handle this. Get out of here, Sierra!
Get out of here. Don't die. I swear to God, if you die again, I'm going to be pissed. And we got to help these guys out. Come on. Can't you just fight your own battles, AI? Ugh. Where is Sierra going? I don't like where Sierra is like heading right now. Even though I'm the one that did it. Lapis. All right, we gotta help out at least a little bit. All right, guys, you gotta pull out your own weight, okay? I hate that Lapis has to do everyone's job right now. Finding these low level enemies right here. Lapis is one of the highest tech military assets and you are squandering it. You are squandering its ability to like, you know, work. Ah, fuck. Hold on. Hit command. All right. We don't have our shields. Okay, now we do. Uh, gotta protect mothership. Gotta protect the mothership. Ah, ah, ah. Dude, I'm just going. Ah. Deliver me. Lapis, you better not die out there. We we kind of need you. All right, we gotta look at uh, let's see, he still has his stuff. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Are we getting? Did we get him? Did we get him? Yeah, we got him. We got him. I think we got the admiral. Okay, Lapis is down. Did we get the admiral? No, we didn't get him yet, but he's down. All right, now finish him off. Finish him off. Finish him off, Junius. Julius. Come on, Junius. Let's put all of our things on weapons. Forget the shield for right now. And, and healing. Put them all weapons. Yes! We did it. We did it. We did it. Not, it took me nine minutes. My lord. We got S. Boom! Damn, genius! Remind me never to piss you off. Proceed. We got him, fools. We, mm, uh, we got him. We got it. It seems that I have. <laughs> I was the one unser undeserving one, after all. This is your last chance. Surrender. It doesn't have to be like this. Naive to the end. Hmm. Hmm? Massive energy re readings coming up from that ship, Captain! Pull back, Fahrenheit! It's not worth it! You! Everyone, pull back immediately! I suppose it was my mistake accepting such a hopeless post, but what choice did we have? A sacrificial lamb is made to die for the greater cause! It was an honor to have served with everyone one last time! It's about to go critical! You can still stop this! So Sur Just surrender! Sorry. Why? People go to war for a reason. Bruh. Damage report. We're in the clear. We're in the clear, sir. We're in the clear, sir. Our readings, our shields took most of the damage. Good. Request permission from HQ to withdraw, withdraw from the battle. I want all ships in Lapis to retreat to Orbit 8 and undergo immediate maintenance check. If there are no problems, we will join first and support third in capturing what's left. The, the reason people go to war. I swallow, pressing down the swirling emotions, threatening to overflow my face. Were we so different? I wonder. Da 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 ba da ba 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 and I will do this next time. Give Peterson the damage reports and all of that jazz, you know? I'll do it next time. Alrighty, I hope you like this episode. I really do. Now, I got a few favors to ask. Like button, 
subscribe, bell notification, and comments. If you would do all of that, that would be pretty swell, you know? <laughs> Alrighty. I really love this game. And I get really addicted to the combat. Like, with the new Lapis combat, like, I loved it. Just going in like, being a Gundam. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna lie, that was awesome. Anyway, hope you liked today's video. Alrighty, this gets in farewell. And as always, 